This morning and start today, we are not trying to work up a sweat. This time, we are focusing on exercises to help correct our pasta. Our, pasta. our pasta. That's the next segment. Whoa, whoa, we'll whoa. <laughs> Yikes. We correct Posture. all the pasta we've been eating. After hours of being <laughs> so I'm like, this pasta there. Laptops and Sorry. phones. There's some easy exercises. Sorry, Doc. Did you know we're professionals? Easy actually? exercises. So you were worried about me. So here today, we have board-certified clinical specialist in orthopedic physical therapy, Dr. Karina. Karina Wu, good morning to you. Morning, good morning. I will not look at the pasta when I sit in this chair. Okay. So the first one we're talking about is tech neck. Text neck. Text neck. Text yes. neck. Oh, I thought it was from when you're on technology too often. Your neck hurts. Well, both. No, you yeah. can call so it either. Kind of, that Same is, yes. thing. So how do you? She always wants that? to call things what so, she wants to call. Them. <laughs> no, exactly. First things first is you want to put the phone in the correct place. Okay. So most oftentimes people it's hold down. their phone down uh -huh. here. It's not good for your neck. It causes okay. that pain. So you want to place the phone up towards eye level, uh -huh. but don't put your arms out because it will tire your arms. Okay. So you tuck your elbows in at your side okay. and just relaxed comfortable position hold mm -hmm. the phone here and then the next part is place your head back in space over your torso ah. because for every inch four your head sits over your torso mm -hmm. it increases the load in your neck by 10 pounds does, Dr. Really? Does, it, does, it, does it make a difference people are do, adjusting for their eyes so. yes i know yeah. i'm over 40 so yes yeah. you want to put it in this general vicinity mm -hmm. but you know if you so need what to do this for every vision. what was that for every inch like forward, this. your head sits yes. in front of your torso. It increases the load by 10 pounds in your neck. That's, That's what causes the neck pain because all the muscles are straining. That's okay, good. so talking so, about uh, alignment, head so, alignment. So the head posture. alignment, one of the exercises we give is pigeon neck. So you're pulling the head back in space. Like that, yeah. This is when you're... <laughs> Looking oh. like, see? Are you <laughs> going to come out? <laughs> are you putting your head back in space? And then you also want to place it there and just keep it there because oftentimes we are forward headed. It's kind of choking me while I'm doing forward that. I've had tie on. Okay, are you so supposed to do this? <laughs> you don't want to cut off your blood. <laughs> okay. oh, that's yeah. Seriously, you're supposed okay. to do that during, throughout good. the day? Okay. Yes. Right. So you want to correct that. So okay. then what we want to do is we want to correct our posture. So okay. let's go I ahead do. and take a seat. Oh, yeah, how about so for hunching exercises. forward? If you, yes. Like, I'm a, I'm a hunter. Me too. <laughs> Everyone is forward-headed, forward shoulder. Yeah. So we yeah. want to correct it. Okay. I like to do some mobility first. Okay. So we're going to do shoulder rows, nice, easy shoulder rows. So really squeeze the shoulders up, squeeze Ooh. back, and really pull them down. That feels good. You might yes. feel things mm -hmm. clicking, popping, but this helps loosen up Ooh. the muscles for the next exercise, okay. which is going to be scapular squeeze or shoulder blade squeezes. So okay. arms up at 90-90. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. You're going to really squeeze your shoulder blades back and then let them go. Oh. So this exercise is to turn the muscles on in mm -hmm. between the shoulder blades that helps position the shoulder blades on your torso. Chanel's flexible. Your forward what? You're bend. flexible. Oh, look, and the control room. Oh, look at the control room. Very nice. Nice. Yeah. Look, Allie, keep it. going. I love that. How often should we do this? Like, you can we do, do these several times a day. Seven five times to eight reps. You're not, you're not turning into an exercise session. This is for a correction of your posture. And what about core strength? I feel like that could core be part strength? of it. Yes, that's another part. But let's get moving into the spine extension. Because okay. Poor, poor posture is a forward and down position. Mm -hmm. You want to go up and back. So clasp your hands behind your head. Yep. Elbows are wide. Heads resting in your hands. Yep. And then just go ahead and backward bend. So this is a great exercise because it really, oh. exactly, opens up the front Oof. of you. Mm -hmm. And then it Oof. corrects that forward and down posture by bringing your body and you know who's been sweating and, uh, we're all sweating <laughs> <I know. laughs> you can see sweating. Uh, yeah. okay so that's well me and jerry were on you know? spine correction okay and then after that we're gonna do a nice big chest stretch so arms forward palms together mm -hmm. bend your hands backwards so bend at the wrist sweep your arms straight back really open up your chest Ooh. pull those shoulder mm -hmm. blades back mm -hmm. pull the fingertips back bend forward the hands and then bring the arms straight back. That one feels good. great. This Ooh, is a good. great stretch because it really stretches your chest muscles, your arm muscles, all the way down to the palm, and it tensions the nerve, so it gets everything from the chest good. all the way down to the fingertips. That feels it's a really right. important stretch. Dr. Wu, really you are good, awesome. This is awesome. Good. And well, anybody can do this, right? Anybody can do we this. We can all sit in a chair. There is one more if you want to do it. Yeah, sure. Real quick. Okay, we're out of time. Seated really quick. Cat cow. Seated cat cow. So feet hip width or shoulder width apart, okay. hands resting on the knees, and then just tuck your tailbone under mm -hmm. and round your spine. This is the only time we let you do that. And then tuck your tailbone oh. out and arch. Dr. So Wu, thank you forth. so much. Thanks, Dr. Wu. And by the way, if you want to see these moves again, you can check them out at today.com start slash start today.
Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.